quickly. We try to make the recording. Um, uh, there's lots of people coming in here, but it's just, they're, they're, all they do is harass and, you know, the wrong type of people. Is that they see, I try to make a recording, and they, they come. I want to tell you, first of all, that we were trying to make another, uh, uh, that my beloved says he can speak, and our beloved our Rothschilds come, and wanted me to see and remember what they had done. We own all these things, and so they said, and um, um, so we made another reservation, but then when I got there, they tried to keep me from having the reservation, keep me from having the reservation. They tried to change the price of it. They said, it so we know that um, there, there was something wrong, but what everybody wanted me to remember was my beloved Zikin Shvit, and beloved our Rothschilds family, and our beloved kids will still won't remember that those, those homosexuals were trying to take our identity. Trying to identity, my beloved came out shop to shop and night. And we caught them, we were little kids. Okay, so we owned that hotel chain, false vine. We owned that. As I said, and the one that was giving us trouble at the other other hotel chain that we owe Evis, you know, it was we caught it with another man. And I got to see when it stood up, it was actually a man pretending to be a woman. Because we they, they wanted us to see what they had tried to do, they tried to um, use our names and try to come into our things if we would try to uh, if uh, if they could. And there had some people helping them that were trying to get into our hotel. Hi, bookings. You know we own you, right? We own bookings.com. So we didn't we didn't keep the reservation. Is it said so? You know they would try to do stuff. So we're we're telling you this way, well, everybody. Was it so we don't tell that too? So they were caught. They're they're being arrested for all the criminals trying to hurt us and trying to take our things. We don't tell that too. Also in our other hotel chain that we own. Okay, but said those fake Ethiopians, they broke into our hotel one night. But said, and they had a good one had a gun. He climbs up and came. We were we were in the bathroom and we were in, we were in the shower and in the bathroom, and um he was shot. He had a twin, bank robbing twins, and he had, he died in our room. And he was he, he said that he was sent they were sent by the bad Americans trying to try to kill try to take our thing. But said we wouldn't tell that too. So the people you see attacking, they're the ones that came to try to kill us and take our things. Like God said, they're just like everybody else came to try to kill us and try to take our things. You know, my knee hurts, but it's the other one this time. I'm sure they did something to it. It's not moving around to a different spot. We just want to tell that too. So we just want to tell you. So they, they actually got caught trying to kill us and trying to take our identity and trying to take our things. So yeah, we own the, we own the hotel chain. Um, at, um, the one you saw said uh, this, this, uh, this today and yesterday. We own the, we own the false blind too. But so, you know, everybody was, we don't like this when we try to talk to you. Everybody else tries to tell lies over us. We don't have anything to do with these people. They harass, they tell terrible, terrible lies. They're really sick. We know that these are people who try to poke your eye out. We know that. You know, everybody been to Facebook, the, the, the first Facebook, which you saw, but Love Rough had Facebook where they poked me and and pierced my septum. It was a homosexual man that did that. He's been arrested. And first of all, they broke my jaw. There were three American gay soldiers that, that were being arrested for trying to kill my husband. We were little kids. They were trying to kill me and my love. We were little kids. They were being arrested in Turkey. They were finally arrested because I, they were finally going to be arrested because I had finally been rescued. They were never allowed to leave Turkey, and um, they broke my jaw. One looked out, the other one stepped on my face, and the other one, and and, and and while the other one, one pushed me down, one looked out, the other one stepped on my face, tried to kill me. But they said they were arrested. They were dealt with like four weeks later. They had, had to send me to Bulgaria. There was another one, all imposter Charles's, imposter Charles, Charles Dudu, and uh, and that breast implant thing. On the back of the saw the bad American government. But to everybody else, what they did. And these people, they're sick people. Everyone else, these are sick people. They're harassing me all the time about what they're doing. They're dirty, nasty, stinking, cursed bedroom. It's filthy. It's illegal to harass a person like that. We know that they're criminal. Also, I want to tell you um, that you know that the, that the, they they sent blacks out too. They're not really from any place but America, like the whites that are doing. Everyone else is there. That, and, they, and Bulgaria, we had a problem, but the Bulgarian immigration let us know that the Americans got false documents said they were from Bulgaria, so they got deported to, to Bulgaria. But we know that those blacks. Couldn't possibly be from any place but America. That's what we said to the West. We said to they, they look American, they act American. We remember that they came we said, and, and trying to tell lies and do things to us. We, said, we found out this was what they were, and, and, and um, it, you know, they didn't act right. And so they said they, they were asking me trying to steal gold for the bad American government, like how they hurt the Rwanda, and like how the whites went and did ethnic cleansing. They were now they were trying to come up to the Albanians. They were not Albanians, not close to the Albanians, were they? It's a holy, holy, us, we're all king and queen of Albania. They were doing bad stuff, and they were, they were, they were ethnic cleansers, the white ones. But said, and they weren't Albanian. But said, and they came here to try to hurt people, too. There are people that tried to do things to us like everybody else. God said, like everybody else who came to try to cleanse us. So they did that, too. And they, like everybody else who came to try to eat us. So God said that, too. Okay, now, we're going to have uh, Pesach again. We're trying to explain, uh, and the rabbis will explain that uh, later. But Pesach, Pesach, Shani, how it's going to be a whole entire Pesach. So... And how how God uh, explained it. So um, we talked to our people about it uh, earlier.
and then they got to see the our people, our, our security people know what what my eyes can look like. We don't lie. We, we tell the truth. Those people are really dead. These people are really disgusting. I am so sick and tired of, tired of whores and homos. And they, they, they try to force themselves on you. It's not it's not correct. We know that one day there won't be they won't exist anymore. And it'll be a happy day when the bad people are finally gone bothering everybody and doing things to people. Because people I don't want to hear about what they do in their dirty cursed bedrooms. It's cursed what they do. And they try to force it. That's all they talk about. All the day and all they do dirty things. They do bad things all the time. Okay, so, and, and nobody was here. We're holy people. We don't want to hear about their dirty, nasty, and they lie on everybody. They're liars. They do ter terrible things. And they say every, they think everybody else is a liar. Everybody's not a liar. They're lying. They lie about what they do. It's not our right to be a, a homosexual or a whore. It's not all right, people. They, they're, they're disgusting, and there's just like some over here now. Do you remember what I did the other day? And they were getting all loud, making all kinds of noise. Okay, well they're, they're trying to drown me out, and I'm making, I'm talking to you. Nobody wants to hear from them. No, and they're, and they're caught. They're liars. They're dirty, filthy liars that don't do anything but talk about nothing. And it's wrong. I don't want to hear about the pornography. I don't want it. I don't want it in my brain. I don't want to hear about it. I don't want to see it. And that's the gift for being like that. But it's it. Nobody, nobody of ours accepts him or takes him, and they don't have the right to try to force themselves on us, and they don't have the right to try to force me to speak to them or talk about what they do. We know that they would attack us. But the broken jaw, gay soldiers, male gay soldiers, and the pierced septum, they tried to knock my eye out. I have a scar. We want to tell that too. So um, and, and another gay. So we know we know that the gays are trying to take the horse. And we, we told you what Mark... Abdul uh, Mark said, and so also, and, and so what God told him. Also at the at the hotel chain that we own, um, Abdul uh, Larry Page, Abdul uh, 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 Sergey Sergey Green, Abdul uh, um, uh, Bindo, Mark Zuckerberg. Um, we were there. Were, oh, we had meetings here at the hotel chain that we own. Mr. So everybody remembers them. Our hotel workers that are old enough to remember that. Also at the Starbucks when we were open because we're the owners of Starbucks, so were they. And we walked in with our with our glasses. It's, a, it's the same Starbucks, so we just want to tell that too. Because um, we had like trial open, openings. When they killed our relatives, we closed the Starbucks. That's why the years are off. And then, because um, they murdered us, our, our, our relatives that were over in America from Greece. And they were going to Georgetown. So they'd be doctors, doctors, one a physicist, and one a medical doctor, and they were, they were Greek royals. And we're also, we were also trying to prove that the Americans were crooked, like they do. They you know, have this, this disinformation, art of Chinese war. They fight like that. We don't lie. We have the book of our God's wars, and God never lied in one. People lie about everything, and we know that they're wrong. Our God won every war. So we, we have that book of Adam the King. So these people are liars. Okay, so our relatives were murdered, and a, a small Starbucks with two chairs and two tables, you know, two, two, two table Starbucks, and nobody saw who did it. We just know people try to saw people like this had something to do with it. But so, so our, our relatives they would never make it back home. They didn't. They died. They were Jewish. They were, and this, these people are trying to cover up, trying to help them cover up. They're trying to steal our things. It was in Georgetown where there's a big hospital. There's a secret service going up and down the street. The vice president lives there. Nobody saw. Okay, so we know. We know that the Americans did that to our relatives. We know they, they killed them. It's just it. So these people, these people go, they rob and kill to get their food from their stomachs. You can, they can't possibly do anything. So all they talk about is nothing all day. We don't, we don't want to hear them. But we don't have anything to do with them. See, they're talking over me? It's homosexuals. They don't have the right, people. They don't have a right to talk to, to my family or me or anybody that I talk to. They're disgusting. And they lie about everything. It's not all right to be sinful. Okay, so now, Shavu told, and we'll talk to you since we can't try to discover but they have something to do with hurting us physically. They would actually try to kill us if they could. So we'll talk to you if we can.